of sales. This is important. I want you to write this affirmation down. I'm an energetic match for success. Now you can do all the sales things, right? You can do the sales funnels, you can do the nurture sequences, you can do the Facebook ads, you can get your copyright, you can do everything, and then you tank it with your energy. Because here's the truth. When we sell, we're slightly embarrassed about it because, do you know why? We get all up in our own heads, we get all in our own bodies, and we make it about us. Sales is so not about us. In fact, I kind of want to take selling out of everyone's vocabulary because it's not selling, it's sharing. If you're not, and I say this to my clients all the time, they laugh and they comment about it on Instagram all the time. My coach is telling me not to be selfish. I actually say, don't be a selfish bitch, but they're a lot politer than me. But don't be a selfish bitch. Don't hold back what you have to bring to the world because you know that the stuff that you are bringing in the world is so super powerful and that everyone should have access to that. So stop being apologetic about it. Stop being, stop holding it back. Stop holding it to yourself. Stop going, the, the thing that I did in my training, right, like I, obviously I did a whole mass of meditation and we did all of these journaling prompts and we went through the whole process, but kind of what the bit the, that I want to share with you today as you go to a party, right, Pav, I'm in New Zealand, so here's my Pav, it's my signature dish, and um, so I go to a party, and I'm like, mm, here's my Pav, it's, you can see it's a little bit burnt on the top, because we're really good at playing ourselves down, right, playing small, because that's safe, here's my Pav, it's a little bit burnt on the top, but um, will you just have some, I'm going to be so offended if someone just didn't have some, that's how we're selling, why the fuck are we selling like that, why are you not coming and saying, this, this bitches, is my signature dish, and it's freaking awesome, if you don't taste this, man, you are so missing out. Now, why wouldn't you do that? Why do we instead come with an energy of, oh my God, I hope someone takes it and I'm going to be so offended if they don't. Why not instead come with the energy of like, wow, everybody wants this. Like it really is that simple. Well, I say it's really that simple, right? An energetic shift actually takes some work and it takes someone on your team helping you do it. But that's the crux of it. You have to change how you feel about what you're doing. I can give you the best sales funnel in the world. I can scroll through all of your offerings and refine them and make them great and help you work on your client avatar and then help with the nurture sequence and then help with your freebies and then build out a funnel that actually works for you. But if your energy tanks it, it's always going to tank. You have to raise both up at the same time. Is it normal for a business coach we're talking about the energetics of selling don't really care this is what works right what works is having the structure but also having the other energetic side that comes alongside it that's how I get the results that I get I don't just work on the one thing I work on the two together and you can't just always work in the energetics oh um, I'm just gonna stand here and magnetically pull my clients to me sure but they have to be able to see you right so you actually need all of the systems that go with it you need both of those things and that's why I bring both those things wishing you a fabulous day forward I better go I'm gonna go and coach my next group of badasses um if you want to find out more about being in my inner circle or in one of my coaching groups or even one-on-one -on -one coaching with me I have one space left um at the moment then um have a chat with me today's the day have a great day and remember together we shall rise